So I was doing a couple, little bit of casting and uh, just to spend, it was cold, you know, I kind of forgot my jacket. Oh, man. And uh, just casting around this and that, you know, it got dark a little faster with this uh, more overcast. And uh, casting towards shore, I remember even saying on the camera, like, ah, oh, to cast towards shore, I haven't done that. I cast close to shore here for once. A little rocky bottom. In the first cast, I latched onto this thing. Oh! Holy sh! Holy sh, guys. Dude, I have. Holy sh! Holy sh! I have something on. And I'm like, holy crap, this thing is. It is fighting. Um, you know, I'm trying to, you know, keep keep him uh, uh, from going around the pier, which I'm like, I'm gonna, he's gonna get tangled. Oh, don't go. Oh. oh, dude, my heartbeat's freaking going 100 miles an hour right now. I have no idea what this is. Oh. Holy shit, guys. Oh, it's a freaking brown. It is a beautiful freaking brown. Holy sh! Okay. Uh. Beautiful freaking fish. Oh my god. If I get him close, he freaking chomped on it too. And uh, I basically got him to the point, which you guys will see in the video, um, where um, I need to grab him out of the water. Um, the net would have been amazing, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I didn't have one of those. You know, don't really bring a net down here. Okay. Come here, buddy. Um, I shouldn't have grabbed him by the tail. I, I knew better. I knew better. Um, I went for the mouth the one time and I couldn't get it. You know, the hook was in there, my lure was in there, and it was it was my prototype crankbait. So I'm pretty excited about that. That uh, I got a brown a brown trout, very nice brown trout, beautiful. Um, hopefully, I got a decent uh, you know video of it somewhat. I'm sure you guys will see me fighting it, but. Uh, you know, I got up a, up close and personal when I went down to grab it, and obviously my chest mount is shoved into the pier, so you guys can't see anything. All right. All right, guys, going in for the grab here. Beautiful fish. Oh my god. But uh, yeah, I went to grab it by the tail and uh, bring it up, and it was so close. I had one hand on it, then I grabbed my other hand on it, tried to pull this thing up, and it just slowly slipped. It slipped out. He started splashing. I'm like, please don't snap. Please don't snap. And I just see my line get taut, and uh, just snapped the line. Uh, it snapped. It snapped right off. And he was gone. Just like that. As fast as I got him, he was gone. But uh, all in all, I mean, it's pretty pretty dang exciting. Uh, this is the, like, you know, just the most, most action I've had with casting out here. I mean, I've randomly caught a pike. Um, I mean, you see people uh, catch, you know, trout and stuff, but uh, mostly they're using the spawn right now. Um, that that uh, that crankbait proved to be trout worthy. So that's pretty exciting. But uh, <laughs> my lure, my lure, uh, my lure worked. But uh, I failed uh, to get it to get the fish to land the fish. Um, well, I guess uh, it's definitely gonna push me to get out here a little bit more and uh, do some more casting. I have nightmares. Mm -hmm.